look at the state of that. We had a dust storm due here on Friday. It didn't uh, didn't arrive. I could see it on the horizon, but it did rain, and I guess a lot of the dust was caught up in the rain, and it covered most of the cars in this area. I haven't cleaned it yet. It's now Sunday. Never mind. I'll do it later. <laughs> Nice empty skate park. Good morning. Right, this morning I'm going to try and land the front side axle stall. I haven't really tried it yet, so this would be the first time. I'm a bit worried about it, but let's see how I get on. And I better hurry up and do the filming as well, because um, I'm part of an Instagram group that come down here and skate. And they'll all be down here. Well, some of them, and, and I noticed on the group messaging last night that some of them will be coming down this morning. So I kind of want to get the filming out of the way, because I do, really don't want to talk to the camera in front of everybody else. I'm still a little too self-conscious. <laughs> quite sure how to turn into that. Well I do know how, I've just got to kind of force it but it's it's quite scary. Love it, you Completely different to the backside axle stall. If I can just start to get over the coping, that will be you know, a small bit of progress. So different to the backside one. Look, watch the backside one. I try and do it first try. So much easier facing down the transition than it is with your back to the transition. Okay, that was second try. But you get what I mean. It's much easier. Okay, I've just had a thought. What happens when I actually get on the coping? How do I get off? Because look, when I get on that coping, the trucks are going to be pushed up close to the coping. And so I somehow have to prevent this wheel going back over there and then that happening. When you do the backside one, you push, you push that out like that. Then it, you push it out like that and then you kind of just pivot around and that back wheel there, that doesn't go back over the coping. Someone did tell me you kind of just pop it out. You just pop it out, but I don't really know what they mean. I think I have a problem, so I'm going to try it on this smaller section first, see if I can get the courage to drop in uh, front side.
I'm going to save doing it from the top when I actually get an axle stall. That position is absolutely terrifying. Love it, you will see, say. So close that time, just got a bit scared. so good, so wonderful, so pleased I've done it. Well, that's the end of the session. Um, I did it though. It was one, this is one of the scariest things I think I've ever had to do. Going on, going down backwards like that. Try it, it's bloody frightening. But anyway, it's got, I'm glad to have got it done at last. Right, end of the session. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.